this is just what it looks like. Tripping over us, she catch me every time. Cause you're my melatonin at 2 a.m. when I'm stoning in a state of mind. Alright, I am switching up breakfast today from the usual breakfast, and I'm having some protein waffles. And I put some strawberries on there. These are the Kodiak Cake Buttermilk and Vanilla Protein Waffles. I found these through Molly Bailey in one of her What I Eat in a Day videos. These things have 12 grams of protein, so that's cool. Um, I threw some strawberries on there. I'm using sugar-free syrup. Um, I'm drinking my coffee. A fun little treat to start my day off. Got my coffee. I'm watching Kayla's vlogs. And I'm gonna get ready for the day. Put some makeup on so we can get going. Bye. Bye. No concealer is going to cover up my dark circles. I've just realized they're just too bad. I've tried so many different things. Every time I try to put concealer on, it just doesn't work. So uh, I guess uh, it is what it is. We're rolling with it, you know? Also, real quick, my friend Kylie Hawkman, shout out Kylie, she commented on one of my work week videos like from the summer like six months ago when i got my travel size better than sex mascara saying that the l'oreal lash paradise is like a great dupe for it they like look the exact same like the bottle and everything so i needed a new mascara like super quick because mine had been like dried out and i didn't have time to like go to sephora or something so i just like ran through cvs when i was on my way to run an errand and i picked this up and she is so right it is so similar it's almost like i would say it's very comparable highly recommend for a dupe <laughs> I'm about to head out now. I'm going to go do my little side hustle, Instacart. You guys know the drill. Um, guys, it is so cold out. It is 25 degrees Fahrenheit. That is way below freezing. It is cold. I'm going to show you what I'm wearing. Nothing really cute, actually, like at all. But it's just like, this is what, this is what the cold is like, you know? Um... So, the heart necklace from Tyron that I always wear. Uh, I'm wearing this champion sweatshirt. I thrifted this for like six bucks last year, I think. Did the bra tuck where I tucked it into my like, little sports bra just so it was more cropped, a little more uh, cute, you know? It's gonna fall out, it always falls out. Um, uh, let me go over here. I'm wearing airy leggings. These are so comfortable. The waistband is so, I don't know, it fits on all the right places, so. Wearing this, and then <laughs> this is the part where it's not so cute. So, um, the socks are Tyrons. They are Adidas socks. Um, I love them, and they keep me really warm. Those are cute. But my boots. The Uggs totally ruin the look, but I don't have any warm boots, really, at the moment. Um, I could wear my duck boot things. Um, I might do that, but I don't really want to because my Uggs keep me warm. So, I don't know. We'll see. I might end up changing my boots. But this is what I'm wearing today. Very wintry. Nothing really cute. Um, oh, and do you see the box back there? That is from the gal's little YouTube exchange that we're doing. Um, I got my package in. We're doing that the 27th. I will finally be able to open that box. And I can't wait to see what's in it. <laughs> but I'm going to go do some mince carts now. And then... We'll see where the rest of the day takes us. Me. 
All right, hello, hello. I'm back at my desk. I made myself a second coffee. I'm kind of hungry again. It's like 10.30, almost 11. I have my planner right here. I was just going over what I needed to get done today. I need to edit today, which again, behind the scenes stuff. And I really want to do um, some Christmas shopping. I got all my stuff sent out for my YouTube gift exchange and like one of my friends who lives somewhere else, but I wanted to get something for my brother, my little brother. I think Tyron and I decided we're gonna do like a gift together, like something that we can both share. That's all I have in my head right now going on. Guys, it is so cold in my house. I just turned up my heat because I am freezing, but um, I am going to make some lunch, breakfast. I'm making scrambled eggs, so I just, I like scrambled eggs the best. I'm gonna make scrambled eggs with sourdough today. I have been going for sourdough or, let me show you my newest obsession as of like this past summer has been English muffins. I tried them for the first time this past summer and I love them. So um, I either do the sourdough or whole wheat English muffins. I usually do the Nature's Promise organic ones from Stop and Shop, but they were all sold out of those because of the snowstorm, so I just got the Stop and Shop brand, 100% whole wheat. I like to put peanut butter on these, and I also like to put jam, like strawberry jam, or the jam that my manager made for us. Um, I showed you guys that when I was in Dubai. So I'm gonna make this. I am watching a vlog right now. I just finished making my thumbnail for past YouTube video that just went up, the last one. I'm low-key proud of it. I don't know why. I just am. Let me show you. If you haven't seen this vlog, definitely go watch it. But I put like a little snowman animation and like snowflakes. I thought it was kind of like festive because it's December. Like mug and everything. Like you should go watch it. Oh, also, I wanted to show you guys this. My friend Holly, when we did our little gift exchange, she got me this phone stand. You put your phone on here. You can do it sideways and upright. It's so just ironic that she got this for me because I was watching Alicia Marie's vlog and she had one of these and she was talking about it. She's like, oh guys, like this thing has been a game changer for me and just like chatting about it. And I was watching her vlog when she was explaining it. I was like, wow, that's so cool. Like I could definitely like see myself having that at some point. And then I opened my gift from Holly and she got it for me. So I'm using it all the time. It's great, especially like getting ready in the morning and watching stuff. I like it. So highly recommend this. If I can find this, I will link it down below or something similar because I really like it. Um, I think she got it on Amazon because we sent each other all our gifts from Amazon because we had to send it internationally. So it's super cute and I just wanted to share. But I'm gonna make lunch now and keep going with my day. There are no Instacarts right now, so I'm just spending my morning editing. Where's my egg pan? It's dirty. Crap. Little bit of garlic salt for my eggs and then some classic sea salt for my sourdough all right food is ready i put salt on my sourdough because the butter is unsalted i should be eating fruit with this but i'm gonna have some later with like a fruit bowl i'm gonna watch some vlogs and finish editing. All right, hello, hello. It is a while, while later now. Um, I don't even remember what I said to you guys last, but I took a shower, washed my hair. Our hair is all fresh and clean. Um, 
my night is going a little unplanned. Um, Austin and I are actually going to go to Target because we're going to meet there um, because we both have to get a few last minute gifts for um, family. I'm getting something for my little brother. Um, I think I've talked about this before. I have a little brother not here at my mom's house. He lives with my dad. He's my half brother, but like we don't really do like the whole half brother thing. Like they're just... He's just my brother. So I'm gonna get him something. I think I'm gonna look for a record for him because I don't ever buy records, but my dad said he's got him a record player and he's super into music. So I'm gonna get him that. And a few other random stuff for myself. Um, I'm looking for something for Tyrant as well. We said we're not doing Christmas gifts this year. We said we were gonna do like a joint gift and then like our birthdays are like in the coming months. So we'll just get each other something then. We have our anniversary in October and then we have Christmas and then my birthday's in January and exactly a month later is Tyrant's birthday. So we don't have much time in between all the events, but then we have like the rest of the year um, not having any like for the two of us, like for other people obviously, but not for us too. So it's just funny the way that like everything works out. But yeah, so that's my plan for tonight. We're gonna get on with the day. It's been a productive one so far. We can fall a million feet. It don't matter where we land when my heart is in your hand. It's like a remedy. And when I can't breathe, join my melatonin at 2 a.m. when I'm stoning in a state of mind. All right, we just got to Target. Hopefully, neither of us spend too much money. But you guys know how Target goes. Like, whenever you're in there, you see every single thing you want. But it seems busy. So I don't know how long we're going to be in there, how much time it's going to take. We also decided to go to Chipotle because we haven't had it since over the summer when we went to Ikea together. And, well, it's been, like, months. So I'm excited. I, I never get takeout, so I'm really excited. Didn't they used to have, like a like, a table of them? For leggings. Oh my gosh. Even though I'm a sucker for cardigans. This is cute. This is a dangerous idea. Alright, I am home now from Target. We ran to the mall. We ended up not going to Chipotle. We ended up getting um, Taco Bell because we were like, let's just get some like cheap shit and like quickly eat and then like finish up our shopping and stuff um i wasn't able to find anything i was looking for for my brother which sucks but i will figure something else out because well there's no other option um but i did get some stuff for myself at target nothing crazy but i still wanted to show you so here we have our little target bag the first thing i got this isn't even for me this is for tyron i got him a few pairs of these i wanted just to grab them while i was at the store got myself some dry shampoo because i only wash my hair once a week i don't know if that's gross to people but i feel like i don't need to wash my hair more than that because i'm trying to use like less like oils and all that in my hair because I know it's like better for your hair to try to go longer um, and it's helped so much I told you guys like at the top of quarantine in March I stopped using heat on my hair for the most part like every now and then I would do something but very rarely and my hair has grown out so much it's gotten so much thicker I got it trimmed a few weeks ago so it looks pretty good just because I don't wash it every few days like I used to um, my hair tends to get kind of greasy at work I don't like the sound of that that's kind of gross but I just got this Hask, is it Hask Chia Seed um, Volumizing Dry Shampoo there's no parabens or sulfates I think I mean I could be totally wrong but I think it's vegan because one of my friends that's vegan recommended it to me. This is just what it looks like. And then I want to use more heat on my hair again because I stopped for a while, but I don't know. I feel better when I do like curl my hair nicely or straighten it and stuff. So I got myself just some Tresemme heat protectant. I used to use this all the time and then I stopped using it and that is when my hair got damaged. So I got, um, a NYX like uh, powder, but it's not in here. I wonder if Austin has it. I'm gonna have to text her because I don't see it on my receipt either. Maybe they accidentally put it in with their stuff. Okay, well, that's not good. Um, well, I had a face powder in there and then the last thing I got was just almond butter packets. They're super cheap, so I like to have these with my apples and I ran out, so I just grabbed a couple of them. That is it for my Target haul, my mini Target haul. I am going to plan my week out just for the coming week because I wanna get that done. I might do a whole video dedicated to New Year's goals just because I did one last year and I don't know if people like really liked it but I want it for myself to look back on and I also might make um another video like for the coming year so stay tuned for those but I'm gonna plan my week and then see where I the rest of the night takes me
everybody it is tuesday it is 7 50 and i'm about to leave for work it's so nice out i feel like i haven't vlogged in my car in a while because it's just it's dark so you can't even see me anyway i work until like 2 30 ish and then i have oh shit oh no the garbage van. Okay, I have to work and then I have Instacart after. I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs> Hello, hello it is a while later it is actually like 4 4 30 ish i don't know i haven't looked at the time you guys know the usual my afternoon routine i just finished editing a video um my laptop in the back is updating right now so i just need to get all the back end stuff done with it that's like what i spent my morning doing and this afternoon it's just one of those days but tonight i am going to run some instacarts because we are getting close to the date that i need to hit my financial goal and full transparency i I've already hit it. A part of it was because of me and another part of it is a Christmas gift. I have hit it, but I want to go more than what I needed now. So I have three weeks to do that. You guys will know why very soon. Big things are happening, exciting things are coming and you guys are gonna be very excited. I just know it. So that is that. I'm gonna run some Instacarts tonight run to the bank. I need to grab some groceries for myself. I feel like I always grocery shop and show you in the vlogs, but like it's just daily life and we're living it. So that's happening. And then I am going up to my family's house for Christmas, I decided. So that will be fun, but that means I am going to have more of a chill few days and then very busy Christmas Eve and Christmas day of doing things. So I will keep you updated, but for now we're just going to do some Instacarts. So I had another coffee when I was on the phone with Tyron and now I'm hopefully gonna be a little more energized, but I need to get going and we will chat in a little bit. <laughs> I just finished making myself some dinner. I ran two Instacarts, but they took a little bit of time. Um, and then I went grocery shopping for myself because I need groceries. Um, I'm not gonna do a haul because I do hauls all the time. Um, it is similar, but I got actually a lot of different things today. If I have any of this stuff throughout the week, I will obviously show you guys like tonight. I just made dinner. <laughs> um, I just made some chicken fried rice. This is basically the same one that Trader Joe's sells. I think it came with a sauce, but it was kind of frozen when I started making it. So I just didn't want to wait for the sauce to like, I don't know, defrost or whatever. So I just made it with a sauce, put some garlic salt on there. We're good to go. There's just some rice, peas, carrots, but that's not going to be enough for me. So then I just grabbed a bowl of grapes. Um, very random. Made some ribose tea just to like relax. Um, I'm gonna go to bed super early tonight, probably within the next hour, but this is just a day of work, a lot of work, um, nothing exciting. I'm gonna be eating all this, drinking this, and then going to sleep. So talk to you guys tomorrow for a full day of Instacart and whatever else I find myself getting up to. <laughs> switching up the angles here. I just felt like sitting on my floor and talking to you. So that is what we were doing. I just spent the morning tidying up, you know, just 
everything, putting clothes away. I did laundry the other day and I haven't been able to put it away. I did that this morning and then in my bed, I was chatting with mom a little bit and here we are. I like to start my mornings off either with a clean space or cleaning my space, either one, just because it just feels better. I don't like a messy space. I get stressed out thinking about it. I am running a little behind today because of the tidying up, but that's okay. I know it'll make me feel better. I'm gonna shower and put some makeup on, get ready for the day, do my Instacart shopping. I don't really have a big plan for the day because tomorrow and Friday I'll be busy with work and Christmas. I'm gonna be going up to my dad's house. I don't even think I said this. I saw him once since being home and I hadn't seen him since October of last year when I left for my trip. So it is time to uh, see him, see my little brother and my grandparents will be there. I just wanna say uh, like with COVID and everything, here's what I've learned <laughs> this past year. There are people who are very cautious with COVID and who take it very seriously. And there are other people who don't think it's a serious thing. And then it like, there's a whole spectrum like in between and past those points of people. So what I've learned, and this is with my family included, that I can only do so much on my end, like when it comes to precautions and safety. And then I have to like pick and choose and decide what is going like what I'm gonna do after that, if that makes sense. So like, I'm all for safety. I wear a mask all the time. I don't really see people. I saw Austin this week that we were out in public and like I went a normal store. It was like bumping into a random person at a store, you know, like we were in public. So I have come to the conclusion myself that I have to pick and choose when it's time to do things and when it's time not to do things. I just wanted to say that they said, wear your mask, stay six feet away. They're all on board with the precautions. I'm gonna be staying overnight there. I'm gonna be in the guest bedroom um, away from everyone doing as such I probably won't vlog because I don't even know if they know I have a channel um, and also I just don't want to vlog this <laughs> this is like family time and this is very very big moment for my family for me to be there for this kind of thing so in a time where this year has been absolute garbage to everyone and has ruined everything for the most part some good things have come out of it but a lot of bad has come out of it and a lot of hurt for people so being able to make them happy um safely <laughs> makes me very happy because this is something that like we've never experienced together because I've never, never celebrated holidays. I always wanted me to be there, but I never could. So I'm very happy to be able to see them safely, of course. So I'm getting emotional thinking about it because I've never been a part of these things. So it sucks that I'm doing it <laughs> like the one year that it's garbage and I can't even like fully be there with everyone um, and fully just like enjoy it without being like stressed half the time. I'm still grateful that I found a way to be safely doing that while also just being able to be there. So I'm gonna get ready now. I'm gonna go shower, put some makeup on, finish my coffee, um, and get on with my day. <laughs> stoplight right now and I just have to say the holidays truly bring out how shitty people drive people really should go back to driving school they just suck that's all I have to say but I'm on my second order of the day I'll probably do another before I go home <music> So it is quite a bit later now. It is 3.45. I just got off the phone with Tyron. We were chatting about a lot of different things and I cannot wait to share with you guys. Life is happening, finally, hopefully soon. Right now, in this moment, I'm gonna run another Instacart order. I've done four today. I'm gonna try to do two more. And this whole Christmas gift thing that I'm trying to do, guys, I gotta get this taken care of. So I gotta find my little brother a Christmas gift. I texted his mom asking for more ideas because my dad gave me some, but not enough. <laughs> so I texted her as well. So now I have some more ideas. So I'm gonna run these orders and then I'm gonna go to Walmart. If Walmart doesn't have anything, I'm going to Target, but Target's like a half hour away, which is why I don't typically wanna go, but I will because then the mall is right next to Target if necessary. So I'm about to hustle. During all of this, I have two phone calls scheduled that I didn't forget about this morning, but I forgot about. We are gonna just hustle over the next couple hours and that is going to be my afternoon evening. Guys, wish me the best, wish me luck. <laughs> Like, 
what the fuck. I am leaving for work now. I am running a little late, as in like very late. So I'm making this short and sweet. How many times in this vlog have I said I'm running late? Been a few. But I have to leave for work now. I'm running late because I had to wear something festive for work today. My car just shut off, by the way. Um, and with the top I was going to wear apparently doesn't fit me. So I had to improvise. I'm wearing a random white sweater. We're supposed to be festive today because it's actually Christmas Eve. So Merry Christmas Eve, guys. I decided to wear white shoes and these Santa ears that one of my coworkers grabbed for a dollar at Family Dollar the last time we had to do this, which was this past weekend. And I wore a red sweater, so I don't want to wear the same thing again. And I do not have anything festive because, as I've said before... The festivities haven't run strong in my family, so I am lacking in that department. But one day I'll get like an ugly Christmas sweater. I don't know, everyone's gonna be more dressed up than me. This is what they have to, this is what they get to see today. So, uh, wish me the best, I have to go. Alright, it is the next day. I didn't vlog much last night because I just drove up here and stayed here and then I'm leaving. I opened some presents with the family and now I'm heading home. I have a two hour drive. I'm gonna try to find a Starbucks on the way home. It's downpouring. It's Christmas day, so I don't think anything will be open, but if they are, I kind of want something and I'm gonna make sure I tip very well because I know they have to work on Christmas and I feel really bad because it sucks. I've had to do it too, so anything I can do to help. So I wanna try to do that, but it was a lovely day. I'm so happy I got to see my family. I, I haven't seen them really in over a year, so my heart feels full. So we're gonna head home now. It's a rainy drive. It is about 10 in the morning, 10.30, so I probably won't get home till like 12.30ish. Well, I'll keep you updated as we go. <laughs> nothing I've been just chilling I don't know if you could tell but my dark circles are horrendous I got no sleep last night so I was like tossing and turning taking the night slow I think tonight I'm going to watch a Christmas movie um, I am going to make my veggies for the week um, or I guess you could say the weekend but going into this week so I have food for breakfast and stuff that's probably gonna be it it's gonna be a chiller night it was a lovely day the day has flown by like I don't like I was just, I was up at like seven my brother woke me up my little brother we opened all his gifts I got a few gift cards for Christmas tomorrow I have to work I work at 6 45 in the morning so so I'm gonna get on with my evening and we'll see where uh, the night takes us <laughs> 